which turned out to be a family of rambunctious raccoons and not a pesky poltergeist as previously reported. And this just in, there's a fire being reported by the old Native American Indian Lake of Utilati on the south side of town. Some eyewitnesses have claimed to have seen an aircraft or a meteor of some sort and land and burst into flames. We have a reporter live on the scene. Don Dimmer, Don, are you there? Nora, Nora, can you hear me? This is Don Dimmer reporting at somewhere where there's supposed to be a fire, but I can't see anything. Don, are you at Lake Utilati? Lake? I was supposed to report at a lake? Don, where exactly are you? Oh, I've just made a bit of a mistake. I'll just check in with you in a bit. This is Don Dimmer reporting from the Utilite Closet. We apologize for the confusion. It seems we do have a reporter on the scene of some sort of crash at Lake Utilite. Sandy Slowit. Sandy, are you there? Sandy, Sandy, it seems she can't hear us. Sandy, slow it. Nora, this is Sandy. I can hear you now. <laughs> well, that's good news. Can you tell us what you have found out at the lake? It's a wet lake, Nora. A wet lake with fire coming from the bottom. A wet fire, Nora. Sandy, maybe if you can talk to some eyewitnesses. Excuse me. Could you tell me what happened today? Oh, well, it was raining. I was at my barn, milking my cow. All of a sudden, the barn started to shake. I ran outside with my dog. He was laying down, whining. My tomatoes were squished. It was horrible. I took, oh, well, me and my dog, we started running after the big turquoise spaceship. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then I saw an alien coming out of it. It was big. The alien was humongous. Interesting. Back to you, Nora. So there's a lot of activity here at the lake today. Sandy? I think that person, that thing, might just be an alien. I'm sorry, Nora, but I can't hear you. I think we're breaking up. This has been Sandy Slowit signing off. Be sure to see me all day tomorrow at the State Fair.